I'm Sapna from Spinayan English Academy. Today in our series Stories of Hindu Gods and Goddesses, I'm going to tell the story Krishna Leela Part 3. One morning, Krishna was playing with Balram and his friends. Krishna stealthily went and stole the mangoes which his friends had collected on their way while coming to Krishna's house. The boys knew that Krishna had stolen the mangoes, but they didn't complain. They waited for the right opportunity. That's when they saw Krishna eating mud. They ran to Yashoda and told, Yashoda Ma, your son Krishna is eating mud. Eating mud? Yashoda got wild with anger. She came running with a stick. Before beating Krishna, she said, Krishna, did you eat mud? No, Ma, I did not. Open your mouth. No, Ma, I didn't eat mud. Balram, did he eat mud? Balram kept quiet. Now Yashoda knew that Krishna has eaten mud. Krishna, you better open your mouth. Don't play with me. Amma, there's already mud in my mouth. If I open, you will see that mud. But I didn't eat mud. Now stop all your tricks, Krishna. Open your mouth. Krishna opened his mouth. Yashoda couldn't believe her eyes. She saw the whole universe, the sun, moon, the galaxy of stars, all the planets, the whole universe rotating in Krishna's mouth. She even saw the rivers and mountains. She saw the cities, the palaces, and she even saw Gokulam, where she is standing with a stick to beat Krishna. Yashoda got frightened. Krishna, close your mouth. I'm getting frightened. What is this? What is happening? Then she asked, Who are you? You are not an ordinary boy. Are you the protector of this universe? Are you Lord Vishnu himself? Anyway, you are not an ordinary child. I am happy that you are born to me. I could take care of you and bring you up. Now Krishna didn't close his mouth. Yashoda looked into his mouth and whatever she saw before was not there at all. She could see mud in Krishna's mouth. She went and hugged her son. All his friends who were waiting eagerly to see Yashoda beat Krishna were disappointed. What happened? Yashoda Ma didn't punish Krishna even when he ate mud. They couldn't see Yashoda beat Krishna. So every time Krishna played some naughtiness, Krishna escaped from Yashoda beating him. Narada Muni was seeing all this from above. Krishna had shown his Vishwarupa as soon as he was born to his parents. Now he is showing the universe in his mouth to his foster mother. How lucky Ishoda is to see Krishna's miracle, thought Narada Muni. Narayana, Narayana. Saying so, he went to his heavenly abode. If you like the story, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.